Hey there, sports betting enthusiasts. Welcome back to Circles Off. This is the channel that's all about helping you up your game in sports betting. I'm pro better Rob Pizzola, and today we're diving into more of a beginner concept, but also a crucial concept. What is closing line value, and why is it important to betters? Stick around, because understanding this can make a massive difference in your sports betting journey. I've created several videos on this YouTube channel in an attempt to help educate and inform a more recreational better. I've spoken regularly about the concept of closing line value, but as John points out in an email to us, I haven't really explained this concept, so let's dive into it. Closing line value is the measure of how well your initial bet stacks up against the final odds or the lines that are offered by sportsbooks right before an event starts. To compare it to another industry, it's like comparing the price you paid for a stock to the closing price on the stock market. In sports betting, when you place a bet, you're essentially locking in a specific set of odds. But as the event's start time approaches, the odds can change due to various factors, like news, what other bettors are betting, or other market adjustments. So why should you care about closing line value, or what's often referred to as CLV? Well, let's break it down. Positive CLV occurs when the odds you initially bet on were more favorable than the closing odds. In simple terms, you got a better deal. An example would be betting an NFL side at minus two and a half and seeing the odds close at minus three and a half. Negative CLV, on the other hand, means your initial odds were worse than the closing odds. You got a worse deal. If you had waited, you could have gotten a better price on the game. And now here's the kicker. Betters who constantly find positive CLV are more likely to be profitable in the long run. It's a very clear indicator that your betting decisions are sharper and more informed than the general public's. Don't believe me? Well, I recently interviewed a former trader at a recreational sports book. You can watch that video by clicking the link right up here. And he told me that the single biggest factor that odds makers look for when they're limiting your account is whether or not you are consistently getting CLV. So how can you increase your chances of getting that sweet positive CLV? I've covered a lot of these concepts on this channel before, so make sure you're subscribed, you have your notifications turned on so you never miss a video. But to recap, there are a few easy ways of getting good CLV. The first one, number one, early betting. Consider placing your bets early when the odds are initially released. This can give you an advantage before the market adjusts. If we take a look at Pinnacle Sportsbook and look at their limits, for when they first open NFL sides for the upcoming week, $3,000. Those go up to over $100,000 by kickoff on Sundays because by that time, they are much more confident in the numbers that they have for the game. They believe they have properly priced the game at that time. Get in in the early going. Number two, research and analysis. You can start by thoroughly researching the teams and the players and the conditions surrounding specific games, but understanding the factors that can affect the odds moves makes a huge difference in making informed bets. Player news, weather factors, whether the market likes or dislikes a certain team consistently. Picking up on these key trends and how the market reacts in real time will help you get ahead of a lot of these line moves. And finally, number three, it's an easy one, betting at multiple shops. If you spot discrepancies from one sportsbook to another sportsbook, there is very likely a valuable bet to be made at one of those books. This is why it's important to make sure that you're betting in as many spots as you can within your means, of course, so that you're always ready to capitalize on these opportunities as they come around. Closing line values like the stock market of sports betting. It measures how well your initial bet compares to the final odds offered by sportsbooks. Positive CLV, a sign of sharp betting skills, and that can lead to long-term profitability. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like it, share it, and subscribe to Circles Off for more educational content on sports betting in the future. And if you have any questions or want to cover a specific topic in the future, leave a comment down below. Until next time, good luck with your bets.